Hey, welcome to Straight Down the Middle of Pinball Show Mod Install. Today we're going to install Pin Graphics Power Blades. And I'm going to put them on this sweet, sweet Lord of the Rings here. Um, I'm going to show you guys here in a minute what's in the box. Uh, what's in the box? And then I'm going to show you how to install these things. It seems pretty effortless and pretty easy, uh, but let's try it together. Here's what's in the box. We have our two blades. Fabuloso. And each has a connector running off of the back of it. These are 10 pin IDC connectors. Each of them goes into the male ends, which then splits it to a single line. That single line goes into the power box. And on the other side, that plugs into that, which then plugs into that, which then goes into, I think, 120 inside the cabinet. And that's it. Super simple. This thing's going to look great. So blade number one. Uh, this is what it looks like the front. The back, as you guys see, has adhesives that I'm going to pull off and this cord. So a couple tips that we want to do first. I want to make sure that on these sterns, it's not bad. You have a little bit of wiggle room left or right on the play field. Now some people take the whole play field out. Um, I am not crafty enough for that. So I push it all the way to the side, make sure uh, it is on the levelers, or not the levelers, but the uh, brackets there. So it's pushed all to the side. Uh, what I like to do first, honestly, is I like to make sure that I just have enough clearance. Just kind of a mock rim. Okay. So I know that's where they're going to go. Line them up visually. Pull them back out. And again, you just want to make sure these connectors are free from getting caught or snagged on anything. All right. All right, now, what you do need to know is that on regular uh, side blades, you can do the wet method where you spray Windex on them and then slide them in, they give you a little bit of give. On this, you cannot do that. Do not use Windex or the wet method on these. You just have to hope for the best. Now what I could have done, I guess I could have taken them off, cut these adhesives, taken them off up here, put them into place, flipped up the play field, then taken them back. But I'm thinking about that right now. The adhesives are already off. So we're going for it. I always do a scissor motion to get it into place. Push it down in a couple spots just to hold it in place. I'm going to make sure that you're not too high up or else you're going to run that glass right over the top of it. Should line up pretty good and just kind of work your way down on it. And you're going to do it up to about here where you can reach. And then I'm going to flip the play field up and I'm going to get the rest of it. You can look for air bubbles. On these it doesn't look like they're going to have air bubbles, but you just want to make sure you don't have them. All right. All right, now one of the steps I forgot to tell you guys, before you do this, um, what I did is I ran some alcohol pads to really clean the sides so you can get all any dirt, grime, or dust off of them. All right, so as I'm working my way, I flipped up the play field. I'm going to work my way to the second half, and I've already noticed that I'm a little bit high up here. So I'm going to kind of just pull it off just a little bit, and we're still shimmying it. Lining it up, and then I'm going to work that crease out. All right, and then this wire right here, we're going to lay it right in there for now until our connectors come in. Okay, and then I'm going to install this side just like I did the other side, and then we're going to turn these things on. Okay, so it's as simple as this. You've got your power box. You've got two plugs. Each plug is going to go into this. Make sure it's the right way, Zach. There you go, Zach. Nice job. I'm proud of you, buddy. Can you go two for two here, ladies and gentlemen? Uh, he did. Two for two. Put in the side of that box. Kaboom, kabang. 
And then you can put this wherever you would like. So if you want to put it over here, over there. I'll tidy that up here in a minute. Okay, next. Next, we have to add power to it. This plugs into the side of the box here. High voltage, keep out. Let that be a warning to you. Okay, that's good, that's good. Feels good, clean up the wires here in a minute. Okay, so now you've got your diverter here. Or it's not a diverter, what the hell is a splitter of some type. It only goes in, let's see here. It can go in one of two ways. So you just wanna make sure you're running through that fuse, okay? Think here. What do you think, Schmitty? Is that where it goes? I'd say it goes there. So it goes there, goes through the fuse. Mm -hmm. Then down here you have your power. Again, you are left with two options the red or the blue wire. Don't blow it. Okay. I think it looks good, Schmitty. What do you think, buddy? I like it. I like it. Professional. I don't like where this is at though. I don't like that. Since there's no coin box in here, that's where we're gonna go. I'm gonna tidy up these wires, and that's it, you guys. We can turn it on. Let's see if it turns on now. Okay. So now, since it's tapped into the power supply, once I turn the machine on, the blades will work. So let's get the play field down and let's turn it on together, shall we? Oh, make sure. Look at that. Somebody's going to be cheating tilt bob in here. Make sure it's away from tilt bob. All right. All right, guys. You want to see something just unbelievable. Check these things out. Joe at Pen Graphics, man, you freaking hit it out of the park. Look at this. And when you see stuff like this, how can you not own a set of Pen Graphics power blades if they are eligible for your machine? You've got to buy them. Look at that. Wow. So again, check out pengraphics.com for all your art blades, all your mods, all your, I mean, look at these power blades, speaker grills, mirror blades with decals on them, a little bit of everything. This has taken this Lord of the Rings and has made it just over the top beautiful. This is Zach from Straight Down the Middle of Pinball Show. Check out all of our other videos on YouTube, on Facebook. Follow us on Twitch. And coming soon, you're going to be seeing even more awesome pin graphics products.